We're making shit with Jen P. Making shit with Jen P. Making shit with Jen P. And we're probably doing it drunkenly. With friends! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Today on Making Shit with Jen P, we're gonna be making some Star Wars sangria. And I've got shit to take you to the light side or the dark side, baby, depending on your preferences. We're gonna start with our light side sangria. And I'm gonna let you ladies be my mixers. So, first you're gonna add your fruit and we're gonna do some sliced oranges and some cubed or whatever pineapple just any kind of pineapple you have on hand frozen is even fine but you're going to want it to thaw out before you throw it in we throw it all in yep dump her um, in there yep okay all in. next you're going to add the white wine i want to do that part go for <laughs> it all of it yep pour it in babe. yes <laughs> There's nothing more fulfilling than pouring out an entire bottle of alcohol. I know, right? Knowing that you're then going to consume it. Next, you're going to just stir it all in. Kind of mash if you can. We're mashing? Um, yeah, not anything hardcore. No, just it. to get some of the juices out, exactly, right? Exactly, exactly. To help it kind of permeate the, the alcohol. In the permeate. Ooh. Good word. That's a fancy word. <laughs> That's an ACT word, boys and girls. <laughs> Of blue curacao, and I have my fancy little R2D2 measuring cup. He's cute. He's precious. Ooh. Everybody, don't miss. Don't oh, gosh. Okay, let's try it. 
All right, so this is my Death Star snack bowl, but uh, we're gonna be using it for drinks today. For this one, it's blackberries and strawberries, and you can kind of use as many or as few as you want. This is just what I had, and so we're using them. And then we're gonna add just a red wine. So just split it in half between each bowl. But those of you making this at home, you can pour it into one pitcher. A cup of grape juice, but I'm just gonna use this whole bowl of belches. So do half and half. Yeah, so half in each one. The force. And then a half a cup of orange vodka. It's then funny, I really desperately wanted to take a shot of orange vodka because it's orange vodka. But then I was like, Maybe I should wait till after I drink our mixed drinks and yeah, see if it's gonna be a good time, idea. Last time, by the end of us making the unicorn and dragon and uh, mermaid drinks, we were fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> She's not wrong. I ordered these nifty little Death Star ice makers, and we're gonna throw one in each. That's huh. super cool. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, it's so cute. So these are from Amazon and I will look up the seller. I'll put it in the, I don't know how to get that shit I know, I'm there. teamwork, teamwork, teamwork. There we okay. go. Yeah. Check um, it out, you guys. Look, it's a Death Star ice. ice cube. See, like it's so cool. My hands are clean, we washed our hands before, so it's gonna be fine. This time I want, wasn't it a fighter that took out the Death Star? So I want a fighter. I'm gonna put a Millennium Falcon in mine and Anna, you can have Han or you can have Vader. I will get Han. <laughs> Give her a big Han. Well, I use the big Han. Please look at this. Big Han. Use yes. Millennium Falcon <laughs> ice cube. It's amazing. Oh, well, there, 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 there goes a Han. Han. A little Han. So fabulous. Watch out for down. I feel like one of them is going to be stronger than the other. I do too. And I'm I interested don't know to see which one. Which one? We're topping it off with some sparkling grape. Ooh. A little sparkling grape, right? Same win. I would actually like it better than the light side. Yeah, it's actually, it's sweet, it's smooth. I mean, it is a red wine, so it is a little drier than the sweet one was. It's much drier. Side. But I mean, Obviously. I think that that's good for dark side. It is a little heavier. I think it's delicious, I like it a lot. It is good, it's really good. Now, it's just a completely different. Like, it is incredibly different flavor. Yep, all light around. Side and dark side, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> this is the life we live, ladies and gentlemen. Say you like it. <laughs> I will say um, that I don't, I don't actually like red wine at all, uh, typically, but I do like grape juice. And so with this one, there's something oddly compelling about it. It's like, part of me doesn't want to like it, yeah. but part of me keeps going back, which is dark side appropriate. Honestly though, that orange vodka is what I'm tasting mm. more than anything else. It's kind of just giving it that little bit of citrusy punch to change up the flavor, give it like an extra dimension. Yeah, mm -hmm. so. it, it actually is very good. Yeah. It's very it's different. Really um, if I was gonna sit around and just kind of have an evening and, and want one of these, I would go with the light side. But I tend to lean toward the light side anyway. So what about you? I'm not much for red wine, but I think I would pick this one just because it's more mellow, but it's got a really good layered flavor. Yeah, what about you, Emma? Oh, dark side all the way. And there it is. <laughs> I definitely am tipsy. <laughs> How very light side of you. <laughs> it would have been real light side of me if I did it with the horse. This is not the wine glass you're looking for. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> and have a DD like our good friend here, Taylor. Yay, we got a DD, that's awesome. <laughs> All right, and we are gonna go take this party on the road. See you guys. Later, Bye.